I don't know. Horns is calved. I have some footage. That's all I'm really saying. I'm just gonna go get some more footage. We got a special surprise. So this is footage from our camera in our maternity pen. The volume didn't record. I must not have clicked it right when I was trying to screen record to get the volume to come through the camera. So I've just sped up the footage and um, I'm just gonna play some music while it goes through. So here Mike is just looking over the calf and he was talking to me through the camera saying that he moved the calf to a drier area and he was worried we wouldn't be able to see it. I told him we can still see its nose so that's fine. Here he goes checking out horns because her afterbirth was very full of water still. Now he's taking the pail that we gave her hot water in. Tinkerbell is very curious about the new arrival. Horns is not so sure she wants her around. We left Tinkerbell in with Horns because they don't do well separated. We have tried to separate them before, so we thought it would be a little better and less stressful if we just left them together for now. So for those of you who have watched our previous videos, you guys will know that we've had the vet out and Prag checked horns twice due to her bleeding after her first Prag check and the vet had said, there's only one calf. Well, surprise, it was twins. Hi, this is Carrie with Orkney Farms, and it's like not even six o'clock in the morning, or maybe it's just after six. I'm not even sure anymore. It was five something when, sorry, Duke is pushing against my legs here. It's really snowy out and about in the pasture. I just came through the electric fencing. All the cats are swimming around. We gotta go into this pen. I don't want to let Tinkerbell out, but Mike's not sure he wants to do that. So Tinkerbell's been her support woman the whole time. It's super dark, even with my light on. Yes, babe. Oh, they're super small. So, just in case you guys don't know, there is a term called free martin. A free martin is a heifer who was born as a twin to a bull calf. We do not have a free martin here. Our calves are both the same gender. Orange, can you get a nose? Oh, I should have brought the tripod out. Easy. You don't jump like that because you make me jump. Horns, I need you to get nose, baby. It's sniffling. Sorry if you hear my nose sniffling in the background as well. It was really cold out there and we're all just getting over a virus in our house. Oh, 
I'm not as comfortable as Mike with getting right up in her face. And her horns are down there, so I'm just hoping she'll be nice. There's the other little one. Horns, can you get its head? Oh, baby. Yeah, horns, it's okay. <sighs> Anyways, I didn't bring my tripod out. I meant to. But as I said, it was super early, so I might take a little bit more video. But I really want to get this one's nose cleaned off and get some iodine on its belly button. I keep trying to clear out that one's nose, but it just isn't. I don't have any. Yes, horns, baby, you did a good job. I'm so proud of you, honey. You're not sure what to do. There's two of them. What happened? Oh, no, no. No horns. Oh, please don't, please don't. I think she's past her cleanings. Yeah, that was like cleanings to me. I go get a towel there. She dried them off a bit, but they're just not dry enough. And I'm worried. The sun's just starting to come up over the clouds now. We kept a really good eye on that second calf because it took over a long time to get up and move in. But you also got to keep in mind that it was born a good half hour or more after the other calf. So 
at this point the youngest calf is two hours old mike has been in and already had it up nursing at this point so we're just going to keep an eye on him and see how it goes Tinkerbell's in there checking them out again. I think she's a little confused too as she's never calved before either. Horns is a good mama, always up and down checking on them, making sure they're still okay and still there. Now Mike is out there filling their water trough. I think Ben gives them a bit of trouble here. After Ben pulled that crap, Mike put an electric wire going across the top of that white gate. I didn't get it on camera though. I 
got from the doctors. Uh, from the pharmacy. Maybe it's getting better wind block there, eh? Yeah, it's a nice little corner. I don't know if it's craft here. Oh. Uh, here, hold this light. Oh, here, like this? <laughs> 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 in front of the hay theater, right?
So if you're still with us, thanks for watching. I'm sorry that most of the footage was taken on the maternity pen camera. I'm so glad that at the end of this video we have had both calves nurse off horns. It made me really happy to see that both calves have been on her. Um, again, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more content and I hope to see you on the next video. Leave some name suggestions in the comments. If I didn't say it already on the video, they are hackers.